undesynthesis. What is the meaning of undesynthesis? In the previous video, we take that uh, the testis uh, formed retroperitoneally on the posterior abdominal wall and descend retroperitoneally in the lumbar region, then in, iliac, then in the iliac fossa, then reach the internal inguinal ring on the right side in the six months intrauterine fetal life, pass through the inguinal canal, reach the external inguinal ring in the eight months intrauterine, and on the right side it reaches the bottom of the scrotum just before birth in the nine months. And we said before that the left testes descend one month earlier than the right testes. Therefore, normally the left side of the scrotum is at a lower level in comparison to the right side of the scrotum. What is undesynthesis? Undesynthesis is a rest of the testes in its normal line of descent. It may arrest in the neck of the scrot. It may arrest in the external ring. It may arrest in the inguinal canal. May arrest in internal ring. May arrest in the iliac fossa inside the abdomen. Or may arrest in the lumbar region in its original site of formation. What is the cause of undescended testes? There are two factors which maintain the normal descent of the testes. First of all, first of all, the bus way of descent of the testes should be free, beaten for free descent of the testes to the bottom of the screw. This is the first fact. The next factor, hormonal, maternal chorionic gonadotrophins, which is responsible for contraction of gobernacula, which pulls the testes downward to the bottom of the screw. These are the two factors which are responsible for descent of the tests. If any of these two factors is lost, undescended tests will occur. The main cause for undescended tests in about 80% of cases is mechanical factors. Mechanical factor like what? Short short testicular vessels prevent the descent of the test or short of us or rupture or absence of gubernacula which pull the test is down or large testes or large epididymis which can't pass through the inguinal canal Adhesions or septum in the inguinal canal. Adhesions fix the testes in the surrounding structure. All these are mechanical factors, and these mechanical factors are accidental. I, and, and I think that the accident will occur once, responsible for unilateral undescended tests. Therefore, the main cause for undescent testes is mechanical factor responsible for about 80% of cases and the 80% of cases unilateral. Um, hormonal. Hormonal deficiency of maternal chorionic gonadotrophins. Deficiency of chorionic gonadotrophins affect on the right testes or the left testes sure affect both sides. Therefore, hormonal factors 
which are responsible for 20% of cases responsible for bilateral undescended tests. What is the incidence of uh, undescended tests? The incidence of undescended tests it occur in about uh, 1% of males. Much, much more common in prematures. Why? I said that uh, the tests reach the internal ring in the six months intrauterine. Reach the external ring in the eight months. A premature patient born in the seven months. It is suspected that the test is still in the inguinal canal. And the most prematures are born with on the centers. And just observe and wait in this newly born for about six months. Usually in premature, the testes will descend in the following six months spontaneously to the bottom of the scroll. We said before that the left testes uh, descend one month earlier than the right. Therefore, if you suspect the undescend testes, it occurs more on the right side or in the left side. Any congenital anomaly occur in the late events. Sure, the testes pass rapidly on the left side to the bottom of scrotum, and the right side may be the victim, like adhesion, like hormonal deficiency, or etc. Therefore, Usually, the condition affects the right side. Pathologically, what is the effect of uh, this uh, condition? The effect of this condition uh, in under sentence is the testes remain completely normal until 12 to 18 months. But if the condition is neglected and the testes inside the body exposed to the high temperature of uh, the body, the following occur. Therefore, the treatment should be done before the 12 months to prevent the following changes. If the condition is neglected, histological damage of uh, spermatogenic cells and seminiferous tubules occur about the 12 to 18 months and this histological, histological changes once it starts it is irreversible therefore early treatment before the 12 months is better. If the condition is neglected after 12 or 18 months, the testes stop to grow, stop to develop, become small, soft, atrophic. Sure, there is destruction of spermatogenic cells leading to later on failure of spermatogenesis. And hormonal function is not affected because hormonal function is normal inside the abdomen, outside the abdomen, in any temperature. The hormone hormonal function is not affected and the fourth secondary sex character is normal in this patient. But in bilateral cases, if the condition is neglected, bilateral destruction of the testes and the spermatogenic cells leading to infertility. Um, what is the uh, commonest site for undescend testes? In descending order, the commonest site is neck of scrotum. This commonly in the external ring. This commonly in the inguinal canal. This commonly internal ring rarely 
il est pour ça. Very, very rarely lumbar region. What is the complication of this uh, condition? To remember the complication of this condition, remember hip, hip joint, hip bone, hip, plus CRT, hip, associated congenital oblique inguinal hernia. Why? What is the relation between inguinal hernia and and the synthesis. We mentioned before uh, the processus vaginalis. What is the stimulus for closure of the processus vaginalis? Once the testis descent in the bottom of the scrotum, this le lead, lead to release of chemical materials called the organizers. And these organizers leading to fibrosis and obliteration of the proximal part of the processus vaginalis. Closure of the proximal part of the process vaginalis depends on the send of the tests in the bottom of the scrotum and release of organizers. No descend of tests, no organizers. No closure of the processus vaginalis. And the process vaginalis remain patent, connected with the peritoneal cavity. And in any time, momentum or loops of intestine descend, leading to congenital oblique inguinal hernia. Plus, uh, congenital oblique inguinal hernia, which is very common association with undesynthesis in 80% of cases, um, infertility in bilateral cases, plus psychological trouble. These are hip hernia, infertility, psychological trouble. Hernia, infertility, psychological trouble. There are three T. What are the three T? T. Trauma. If the test is inside the body, it is exposed to repeated minor internal trauma. What is meant by internal trauma? <coughs> Cough, straining, in any increase in intra-abdominal pressure leading to internal trauma. Tumor. In undesynthesis, development of testicular malignancy is about 15 times normal population. Normal males, and this is genetically determined. Usually, there is genetic defect predisposed to this patient to testicular malignancy. And even if on the sentence is treated, and the test is sent to the bottom of the scrotum, and orchidopexy fixation of the cyst in the scrotum done early. Liability for malignancy is still high. Therefore, trauma and the tumor. Finally, and the synthesis is not fixed to the surrounding structure. Liable for rotation, leading to torsion of the testis. Trauma, tumor, and torsion of the testis. Um, what is uh, the clinical picture of undescended testes? The clinical picture of undescended testes, uh, the condition may uh, accidentally discovered. Incidentally discovered during routine pediatric examination of the newly born after uh, birth. Uh, doctor should examine all this newly born infant uh, or fetus uh, just after birth to exclude congenital anomaly. And during routine examination, this routine examination by a doctor after birth, and the sentence may be discovered. Or the mother 
may discover that one side of the scrotum or the both sides of the scrotum are empty with notice or the patient may present by manifestation of complication hernia tumor trauma torsion etc um, examination of this patient general examination examine all the patient for associated congenital anomaly like congenital heart disease etc locally scrotum the affected side of scrotum is empty and not well developed because development of the scrotum is due to the testis inside the testis inside enlarge and the scrotum distend if no testis no distension of the scrotum and the skin of the scrotum is sick and rougy the testis may be felt in abnormal sight may be felt in the neck of the scrotum inguinal canal or need investigation to be seen or felt like high abdominal understand the test um, the test is uh, we can identify the test is during the palpation that it is oval firm slippery structure and the compression of this structure leading to testicular sensation on compression or squeezing examine the area for hernia which is very common association and for other associated congenital anomaly like hypospedias ectopia vasica bifidus scrotum etc may be associated in the local area um, this is a pathology and the clinical picture we will continue um, the remaining part of the synthesis in the following video thank you for good listening and good luck